Hello there, so this is Tiffany and um, I'm a human design reader but I'm also super obsessed with planners and I am doing a layout today that is around, it's a two page spread, it's a to-do list, basically how to pr prioritize a to-do list. If you are somebody who just can't write, figure out what you should do first on your to-do list, this might be something you might try. It was inspired by a friend of mine who said that she always needs to know the consequences of things before she knows how important it is. So on the first page of this to-do list is a place where you do brain dumping and you write, okay, what happens? What is the consequence if I don't do the thing? And then the second page is where you can write and reprioritize everything based on the worksheet on the first page. So if you have any questions, please let me know, but hopefully enjoy this layout. All right, so I'm gonna walk through a layout that is um, how to basically how to prioritize a to-do to list. So it's gonna be a two-page spread. On this page is basically gonna be an area to just dump all the things that need to happen. And then this will be a refinement of that list. And um, once again, I'm using an extra large moleskin notebook. This is the grid, the dot grid um, version of it. So what I wanna do is Obviously, I'm, I'm a big header person, so I'm going to create a little header up at the top so there's space to write on both pages. And then really, this is going to be super simple. I just really want, I want enough space to write all the things that need to happen and then space on the other side to write what happens if the thing doesn't get done. So not quite doing it in half. I'm leaving more space on this side than on this side intentionally. And so then on the next page, what I'm going to do is, this is actually where the to-do list is gonna be prioritized here. So I'm gonna go ahead and create some lines and I'm gonna go every other Okay, I'm gonna stop there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take my marker and start labeling and kind of outlining all this. All right, so just kind of talking through this a little bit, I did a little bit backwards, but basically the idea is to brainstorm all of the things that need to get done, just kind of a brain dump basically, and put them all over here. And you could even create some lines here if you prefer to use some lines. And then on the other side is what happens if the thing doesn't get done? What, what will the outcome be? Um, how serious will it be? You know, what will it impact? And so the idea is to really kind of think through and use this as a worksheet of what is the thing and then what happens if it doesn't get done? What does it impact? How does it impact other people, myself, my schedule, that sort of thing. And then once you've done that, looking at both what, you know, this should help you be able to prioritize and put then a list of the things um, that you need to do that is now prioritized. And you can actually take these lines all the way down. Um, but that's basically how a very simple layout, a very simple way of thinking about the things that you need to do and a way of just kind of saying, okay, what happens if I don't get this thing done? And how, what does that mean as far as how um, important is it to get it done first? So that concludes a simple layout. If you have any questions, let me know.